Hello everyone. Today we will see how to download and upload account opening form via BSC Star MF. To download the account opening form of your investor, go to admin, client details, AOF, FATKA, download. Mention the client code. and click on download so as you can see on the screen it's a single pager pdf file which has downloaded in your system it already fetched the details which you had mentioned in the client master of the investor now the, uh, you have to send this AOA form to your investor and take the signature over here Remember, in case of HUF, non-individual, sole proprietor, you have to take the signature of your investor as well as you have to take the stamp of the firm over here. In case of minor investor, guardian will do their signature over here. So take the signature of the investor over here, collect the form and upload the same in BSC Star MF portal along with the required documents. Now let's see which are the required documents are there for different tax status. As you can see on your screen, for different tax status, different documents are required. For example, let's go with the first one individual. So the along with the UF documents required are cancel check or bank statement. Second tax status on behalf of minor. So for that birth proof of minor along with the AOF and cancel check or bank statement for HUF it is AOF HUF pan copy cancel check or bank statement so like this for different tax status different documents are required because okay, so I am just going through this one by one tax status you can pause your screen and go through this tax status and prepare the documents for the appropriate tax status. Now before uploading the AOF, let's go through the important instructions before uploading the AOF in BSC Star MF. So now as you can see on your screen, there are various instructions to be followed before uploading the AOF in BSC Star MF. The first instruction is that file size should be between 50 KB to 4 MB. Second instruction is file type. There are total three types of file allowed. One is PDF. First is PDF, which is allowed up to three pages. So if your file is up to three pages or less than that, then you can upload the AOF along with the supporting documents in PDF format. Second is JPG. JPG will be helpful, especially in case of individual text headers because we had seen in the previous screen that for, for individual tax status only AOF and cancel check or bank statement are required therefore you can put the AOF, AOF and check side by side or you can put the check above the AOF or below the AOF take the single picture uh, of it it is the good picture of it and you can upload the same documents in JPG format as well and the third format is TIFF so TIFF is allowed for n number of pages. If your file size, uh, file pages are, uh, are going more than three, then you have to upload the AOF along with the supporting documents in TIF format only. Third point is you have to scan the documents in black and white mode. Please do not scan the documents in color or grayscale because it will increase the file size more than 4 MB. Scan all the documents in single file. Therefore, AOF and the supporting documents like cancel check, pan card or whichever supporting documents are there, you have to scan in such a way that system should create a single file. You should not create multiple files for each document. And the last instruction is file name format is like this member ID, client ID and date of uploading. So I have also mentioned the example. 
My member code is 10234. Member code means the distributor code, which is 10234. Client code I had generated test 0004 and date of uploading today's date. Whenever I will upload on that uh, that that date, I will mention over here. So the format of the date is DD MM YY YY. So 1407 In this format, I will provide the name of my file and upload in the portal. Now let's see how to upload the AOF in BSC Star MF portal. To upload the AOF in BSC Star MF portal, go to admin, client details, e-log image upload. Over here mention the client code. So client name and pen number will be fetched by the system automatically. Select the file. As you can see, I had mentioned the name of the file in the format which I had explained you in the previous screen. Member code, client code and date of uploading. So select the file and click on upload. Now as you can see, I am getting the message image saved successfully. It means that account omnic form along with the supporting documents was uploaded successfully in the system. If you want to check again whether AOF along with the supporting documents has been uploaded or not, then you can go to daily downloads, new reports, member reports, e-log image upload report. In this report, you can search via client code, via pen number, via applicant name or you can give the range of date and search the details. Suppose if I want to search the today's client which I have uploaded the AOF, then I will give the client code. I will leave the date as it is because I have uploaded in 14 July on 14 July only. Select document type as AOF and click on view. So if the details are showing over here, it means that AOF along with the supporting documents has been uploaded successfully in the system. Also, as you can see, there is some column called camp state. Uh, there's a column called camp status, which is showing as uploaded ready to invest. It means that this client is ready to invest once you will put the transaction of this investor then the cam status will change to approve if in case the scam status will change to rejected then it will also show you the reason of the rejection over here so you have to rectify the reason and again upload the aof in the system so in this way you can upload and download the aof of your investor via bse star mf Thank you for watching.